we need to compute with these points. We have, in particular, we have to add, we have to add those points, and there's no natural way of doing that. This is something very artificial. This is the complicated stuff of elliptic curves that comes now. So it does all the calculations with the inputs and outputs for us, and it tells us what is currently in this address. the geeky people, like the tech, tech nerds, who are somehow, who, who just believe in the technology. They just believe it can work, and they go for it. And they just start trying to find how to make it work, and how to spread it out. It's just a form of believing in what you're doing. Some of the things will work, and I was telling you that the people from the outside that don't know the technology, they can come up with very interesting things how to use it. They don't know the limits, we know the limits, and we can tell them what what it can be used for, we think. But still, I think the great ideas come when you're pushing the limits 
when the when you when someone creative or someone from a different field comes to us and tells us, but I think we could do that, and we're gonna be like, mm, maybe let's try. Uh, he can, he will prove us that it is possible. So That's yeah. what I like. I like the people that are finding the way how to do it, not the way. Not the excuse not to do it because it's impossible. In the ocean on my mind, I'll find a spark of pride. Precious vision on my failing, failing on the gate. My dreams just catch me so, so I won't be waiting long. And it ends with imagination, I will make you create. The project intends to remain state free as it operates entirely without support from the government, and most of the funds come from voluntary contributions of our donors and partly from commercial activities such as running a unique co working space and the world's first Bitcoin only cafe. Real, real cycle, I fly with your spectrum.